All right, look at that. Beautiful. We are back now with bright red and green northern light spotted in the skies over northern Finland. According to the photographer here, the aurora, the aura there was active all night, dancing and exploding. That wow. is just a phenomenal phenomenon, right? Yeah. Well, NASA says that aurora activity has been strong since the sun emitted a strong solar flare on Monday. That means there is a chance we could see clearly here in parts of the Delaware Valley. CBS News Philadelphia reporter Madeline Wright has more from Center City. John Paz and his son came to the Franklin Institute where they're getting ready for the chance to see science come to life. A phenomenon dad has only seen once, the northern lights. I saw him, I saw them from an airplane flying over Lake Michigan looking to the north. It was just sort of like a green galaxy. It was very cool. The National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration is forecasting a severe geomagnetic storm that will unleash a spectacular view of the Aurora Borealis in a part of the country where it's not normally visible. That includes the Delaware Valley and as far south as Alabama. Here we go. Derek Pitts, chief astronomer at the Franklin Institute, is opening the observatory roof so people can better understand why this is happening. Wow, enormous. Using this refractor telescope, he can see giant spots on the surface of the sun, which he says are responsible for the intense aurora activity. I'm always excited about uh, how active the sun is when it reaches its peak in activity, and that always means more sunspots, more flares, and more aurora. Telescopes like these are powerful tools, but they only show you a fraction of the sky. Pitt says it's best to watch the northern lights with the naked eye so you can take it all in. Find some place where the sky is clear, where the sky is dark, where we have very, very little light from the city at night. And those dark places will give you a better chance of seeing aurora. If you look up at the right time, the aurora might be quite the sight to see. Paz says he won't miss this rare and exciting opportunity. A lot of green. It's, it's, it's pretty, pretty magnificent. If you miss the aurora, Pitt says the sun's activity is still peaking, which means more opportunities to watch this dazzling display. In Center City, Madeline Wright, CBS News, Philadelphia.